we've got action in the ring. The bell has sounded. Awesome. And uh, I don't think they're saying Romeo. I, oh, I get it. Talking about homeopithecus. Uh, I, yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. Roselli sent in. Knox Quint lay down. No doubt about it. Romeo Roselli in fantastic condition. Oh, carved out of granite. Look at this guy. Not an ounce of fat on him. And uh, the rather shiny and shimmering Romeo Roselli is the sheen that, on this guy. Is saying that Quint Lee is greasy, but are you guys admiring Romeo Roselli? It sure sounds like he's that. He's a fantastic athlete, and talk about him glistening and stuff like that. Well, you see, when he accused uh, Quint Lee, who looks like he's been painted with a flat paint, and he's got the high gloss paint on his skin tone it's uh, only natural to start discussing that therein lies the humor pay really? attention no 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 okay, come whatever off. you come say come off while you're ahead of yourself right now Quint Lee with side headlock and Quint Lee got the better of that exchange hip toss there by Roselli I think that was a rhetorical question but uh, Romeo got an answer anyway a lot of strange questions floating around here tonight. There could be a lot of strange questions at the uh, question and answer session coming up at 6 p.m. here at the HWA Arena, part of the all-day celebration. You know, right now, as we speak, there are some young wrestling hopefuls going through that fantasy camp. Some of them could be passed out. Some I guarantee could be, someone's puked. So, oh, guarantee. I'm sure. I'm sure. And I guarantee you better have a mop. Roselli has quit leading, so, trapped in that corner. Is Hooks the official puke cleaner of the Hooks, fantasy camp? Hooks that was the case, darling. You'd have been out of here a long time ago. Um, and uh, Quint Lee sent in. and Oh, drop toe hold. Romeo Roselli face first into the turnbuckle. And uh, I'm guessing Romeo probably has a problem with getting hit in the face. You notice it smells like bubble gum and suntan lotion out here ever since Roselli came out? Oh, he landed on his feet and he said it was cool, and it was rather cool, but uh, right there. Stereo. Exactly. And Romeo Roselli again and getting abused in that uh, face of his. And Romeo Roselli coming out here, and I'm sure because he's in such great shape, he sees Quentin Lee. Quentin Lee, not a, not a stud, not a... Not carved out of stone like Roselli, but he underestimates the wrestling ability of high IQ Quentin Lee. Thought he was going to come out here and have an easy time. Quentin Lee, an amazing athlete, no matter what Romeo Roselli thinks of his figure. Well, this isn't a bodybuilding contest. It... Quentin Lee certainly outsmarting Romeo Roselli. A master strategist is high IQ Quentin Lee. And he's going to need all the strategy he can muster to uh, make it through that gauntlet match and potentially become TV champion once again at Cyber Clash 2.0. Nice bulldog off the second rope there by Romeo Roselli. <laughs> again, we do want to remind you, tickets are available for the matinee show at 4, the Q&A session at 6, and Cyber Clash 2.0 at 8 p.m. If you are enjoying what you're seeing right now, you are going to want to be a part of one of the biggest shows in the calendar year of the HWA and Romeo Roselli now on that second rope. And he still gets the same answer. Ask and he shall receive. And these are tactics we're used to seeing from Quentin Lee. Quentin Lee knows what it's like to be on the other side of that chokehold. So I think deep down he's probably got a little bit of respect and admiration for what Romeo Roselli's doing. Knows he's got to find a way to counter it. Roselli drops to the floor. And now Roselli bringing Quentin Lee out on the floor with him. And this could be dangerous. 
Well, you're not going to win any wrestling matches out on the floor like this. No, but he's certainly doing a great deal of damage to Quint Lee. Referee Skeeter Muldoon telling him to get the action back in the ring. Quint Lee is rolled back in. It's going to stop the count, but what is Romeo? Looks like he's getting a chair. Roselli grabbing a, a steel chair, and is he just trying to get disqualified here? And Skeeter Muldoon trying to reason with him. When Skeeter Muldoon's the guy trying to reason with you, something's wrong. Skeeter Muldoon's oh, barely oh, wait, a wait functioning a adult. It was a diversion. The whole thing a diversion. Romeo Roselli took that armband off and started choking out Quint Lee with it. Roselli now going for the cover. Two and only two. So much to talk about this week on Adrenaline. Still to come right here in the hour. That 10-man tag team main event that's been set up by, by Patrick Black, who, who gave us a heck of a main event last week with Moxie and Whitmer. Well, like I said at the top of the hour, Patrick Black, no one here really trusts this guy because of his, his checkered past. And we're trying to give him the benefit of the doubt. I still don't trust the guy, but he did sign a one hell of a main event for tonight. He certainly did. And Hey, Hooks, is that nail polish you're wearing? Well, yes, it is. Why are you wearing nail polish? Why don't you pay attention to the match? Well, I would kind of like to know why you're wearing nail polish. Isn't that something girls wear? Quentin Lee, head first into the turnbuckle. Now, Roselli, look at him just choking him out with that foot. And Roselli has pretty much run the gamut on chokehold variations here in this matchup. Oh, well, uh, that'll give you a negative attitude. I've already got one. Romeo going for it again, and ooh, once again, uh, landing in a rather precarious position. And Roselli staggers out, walks right into the smart one. Catching those left hands. The smart one. Very good, Sean Mooney. Oh! Quint Lee, the million dollar fist drop. I'll tell you the rest of the story later at the event center. You could go there now if you want. Roselli sent in and what a back body drop right in the center of the ring. Quint Lee could be finishing this one up. Fisherman suplex. Is he going to get it? He got it. Nice bridge. Two. And oh ho. Romeo Roselli getting that shoulder up at the last second. Quint Lee saw that kick coming. Caught Roselli. Takes him for a ride. Oh, and a nice neck breaker there by Roselli. One, two, and oh, so close. Muldoon, uh, his, a lot his of hand, momentum there. But his hand came down, but he, he had his eye on it. He saw it. He said only two. And now Roselli on the top, and oh, Quint Lee catches him. Oh, a rake of the eyes. Roselli. Sunset flip power bomb. One, two, three. And again. Again, Quentin Lee getting that shoulder up at the very last second. Roselli angry, but, but Skeeter Muldoon making the right call. Reverse, no, another re Wait a minute. Oh, look out. Muldoon almost got sandwiched there. Oh, I'll tell you who did get sandwiched. Right between the turnbuckle and Roselli, Skeeter Muldoon, he's out. Double arm DDT. Roselli's out too. Guys. This is it. This Drops is over. Straight on the sexy dome. One, two, three, four, five. I mean. Well, what do we do here? Oh, oh, wait, wait a minute. Ganger. Ganger. Oh. Caught him right in the big brain with a TV title belt. And he's out of here. Like a thief in the night just runs off. And Romeo Roselli going to capitalize and pick up a cheap win. Here is your winner, Romeo Roselli.